Ladies and gentlemen, it is your lovely host here. It is Team Rai. How are you doing, everyone out there? On this Friday's edition, I am doing okay. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, follow me. Please follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok, and my own Facebook page. The link will automatically take you to my page. So hopefully someone out there wants to be a part of the Rara Show. As a guest, we can discuss about random topics. Okay, my viewers, I'll discuss for you wrestling news, wrestling topics, and a lot of awesome information to discuss for you. Now, if you want to do that, or maybe you don't want to do it like that, maybe you just want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions, and that subject. And of course, the article will be down below, or the link will be down below. It will just be an article. Let's get into this. Now, recently, WWE had released a lot of superstars that we know of. Braun Strowman, Alex Black, and the list goes on and on. Okay? The question is, I have for you, why in the hell did W release Braun Strowman? Because recently, he's in the main event. Picture. That makes no damn sense. But, I figured out why did they release him. He had a huge contract. So, instead of releasing him, why they can't just restructure his contract? Then he could stay with the flipping company. Dude, you guys are so dumb. I'm sorry. Stupid. Okay? I like Braun. He's a freaking animal inside of the square circle. But his in-ring mic skills absolutely is trash. Okay? The former W superstar Braun Strowman was... One of the top talent released from the company on Wednesday, most likely due to the high value contract. See, on today, um, W O N, it's on note that Vince McMahon did not have anything creating for Braun Strowman. Wow, really? Had nothing creating for him? How stupid. Okay, now in the past. They didn't have nothing good for him. I remember one time he was chasing Kevin Owens the whole entire ring. You know, around the whole arena. That's what I'm trying to say. Then eventually Kevin Owens hiding in the porta party. Then the Braun Strowman tipped him over. That was stupid booking. Who came up with that? So I heard rumors that Braun Strowman is going to go back to. Um, Lifting weights and all that good stuff. Or maybe another wrestling promotion will scoop him up once his 90 days are done or however. So um, this guy was very good. Well, people loved him in 2016. And for some stupid reason, they did not push him. They give it to um, Brock Lesnar, but... That's another video. So, it's his big contract. Now, why even um, sign him to a big flipping contract if you guys are going to release him in the future? That's so stupid of the WA. How, wondering how Braun Strowman feel about getting released from the company. Probably not too happy. You know, with all that money he was rolling into the company. You know, it's sad. I doubt it. They will ever bring him back. I flipping doubt it. So, but you never say never. But they didn't use him correctly at all. You know, he has some stupid storylines, stupid matches. You know, I think, I think he should be always in the main event spot. But he, the only reason he was champion at that one time because Roman was out of the picture. So when Roman came back, the rest is history. So he's like a, um, not a very good, I forgot the name of the kind of champion it was. You know, like, um, he don't have a long title run, I forgot. You know what I'm saying, but it's BS how they treat certain 
super surfs. If you're not Roman Reigns, if you're not Brock Lesnar, then why even bother pushing the other guys? You know what I'm saying? That's McMahon for you. He needed to make new stars. You know, Alex Black, recently he just came back with it last Friday night on SmackDown when he interfered against Big E. I thought Big E versus um, Alex Black is going to set up that match at SummerSlam, but now um, Alex Black got released. That was so stupid. The whole time he was off TV, if they're not going to use him, then release him. So, McMahon, you're so dumb, you know? This is same thing with um, Braun Strowman. Is it about his contract or what? There's got to be more to it than we don't know about. Any other wrestling company will pick these young wrestlers up. You know, it's very sad. They always say, you know, WWE's wasting great talent. But another wrestling company probably will use them even better. They can't use the same names because WWE owns that name. So what's your thoughts on this, you know? W better do something and then off the record I guess they put Brock Lesnar back on their website on W.com so I guess he's gonna be back very very soon so maybe that's why they release all these people to pay Lesnar that is BS if that's really true you know I like Lesnar but he does not work 365 days a year like these other wrestler females and guys if that's true, I guarantee you the females and guys are really pissed off. You guys released me just to re-sign Lesnar. That would be us. And another thing I'm hearing, it might be Lesnar versus Bobby Lashley. And this year's SummerSlam for Bobby Lashley belt. You know who's going to win that match? You're right, Brock Lesnar. Just like the time when it was a debut show on Fox. And Kofi had to defend the belt against Brock. Brock could just beat the crap out of him. Kobe they had no chance in hell. Terrible booking him from my point of view. Stupid. Very dumb. Just because Brock is a former UFC champion, that does not mean anything. But for Fox, it means something. You know? I guess Brock is a bigger name than Kofi overall. You know? Not just in the wrestling world. Overall. So, whatever. I was so pissed about that. At least, let Kobe have some great offense, but he didn't have nothing. You just got total domination. Okay, everyone. Let me know your honest opinion on this article. Have a good one. And look out for video number two later on tonight. Peace out and be safe. Later.